Welcome to another lecture of Master Computer Vision in OpenCV with Python. In this lecture, we will learn facial recognition using Fisher Face algorithm or model in OpenCV with Python. Fisher Face is another algorithm or model which is used to recognize face in images. Okay. Fisher Face algorithm algorithm is good for light variation in images than eigen face algorithm. The Fisher Face method uses linear discriminant analysis for die Machinality reduction. It aims to maximize interclass separation and minimize and minimize separation within classes. Fortunately, OpenCV provides a face recognizer, recognizer module called CV2 dot face module, and inside this module, Fisher face recognizer underscore create class is built. Then we create an object of this class, Fisher face recognize underscore create and then call its train method the train tra train method is used to train the model and predict method is used to predict the label of new image training steps in the fisher face fisher face algorithm are as follows this is the working flow chart of fisher face algorithm okay first we need train images and, and or read the train images and then if the if the training images are in RGB format, then convert into grayscale. And if if already in grayscale, then detect the faces directly. And then resize image. Instantiate a Fisher face recognizer function and then train the model. This is the whole working flow chart of Fisher face algorithm. The steps during the test phase of the Fisher, Fisher face algorithm are as follows. First, we need test image. Okay, if image is in RGB format, then convert to grayscale image, and then detect face. If if it is already in grayscale, then direct detect face in this image. Then, after detecting the face in the image, then resize image, and then feed to the trained model, and at the end, predict output of the model. Okay, now we start. Now we start our code. First of all, import required libraries. Import CV2 is a computer vision library. OS is the library which is used to interacting with operating system. Import numpy as np and matplot.pyplot.splt is a floating library. First, set the path of training and testing images. This is the path of our training set, and this is the path of our testing set. Training set and testing set folders contain the images read a sample training image okay use im read function of opencv and then pass the path of our sample image and then show the show our sample image run the cell okay okay cv2 is not defined it's mean first cell is not true okay. okay this is our sample image from category 2. This means it belongs to category 2. Now set the path of this RK scale retrained model for face detection by using this line of code. Okay. Now we define a function to detect faces of training images. Function name is detect underscore face and its parameter or argument is input underscore image. Convert, R, convert this image. Convert RGB image into grayscale image by using this line of code. Then load pre-trained RK scale model for face detection and then detect face of input image by using detect multiscale function and passing its parameter. And check if face is detected by using this line of these lines of code and then determine the coordinates of bounding box of detecting faces. At the end, return the face and bounding box or victims. Define a function for training preparation. This is the name of function and this is the parameter of this function. Define two empty lists to store the detected faces and their labels. First, detect underscore faces and second, face underscore labels. Access the list of folders or directories of training images inside the training images folder okay, by using this line of code. And then iterate through the list of training folders. Set the label or category of images. We use this line of code. 
set the path of each folder of training images with this line of code and get the list of names of training images with this line of code and iterate through the list of names of training images. Get the path of each individual image and then read each individual individual image. After reading the images, then detect the face of each image by calling detect underscore face function which is defined in previous cell and pass the image. Okay, this is the each detected face image because ag again, sorry, feature face algorithm accept the same size of all images. Okay, store or append the detected faces and labels into the two lists and at the end return the detected faces and their labels. Detect face images and their labels. Detect underscore face, face underscore labels, and then call the above function and pass the folder of training images. Okay. Now print the print the total number of training images and labels or categories which we are accessed in this by using this function. Okay. Run the same. Okay, we have we we detect one hundred ten faces and one hundred ten labels. OpenCV is equipped with face recognizer module, so we use the Fisher face recognizer underscore create recognizer module from OpenCV. Actually, this is the class which is which belong to module face and which is the part of CV2, and then we create object of this class Fisher face recognizer underscore create. Now train the face recognizer module. Fisher face faces underscore recognizer and call train function and pass detected faces and face transfer labels in numpy array version. Define the draw rectangle function which is, which will help us to draw a rectangle around predicted face by the above model. Okay. And define the write text function which will help us to write label of predicted, predicted face image by the model. Okay. Awesome. Actual label of image. These are our actual labels or categories or class of our images. Define a predict function. Okay, pass a predict is the function name. This is the parameter of this function. Detect face and rectangle by calling detect underscore face function by using this line of code and then resize the image and then get the predicted label and then draw the rectangle around the predicted faces. Predict face call write text function to write the predicted category of the image and then return test test image and predictive label text okay now we will see now we will set the model with test image we read a test image from category 2 and this image call the predict function to predict the label of the test image okay Use predict function and pass our and pass our test image. Run this in. Now we show our result and see and see what is our output or predicted output. Run this in. Okay. This our actual class is two and our predicted class is also two, and this is the face of our image. And this is the category or predicted class of our face. This is the whole process or working of Fisher face algorithm. Thank you very much. See you in the next lecture.